What's going on everyone? Today we are taking a look at the Cable Creation 10-in-1 dock with a built-in air purifier. Taking a look at the specs, this has a total of 10 ports which we'll go over shortly, a built-in negative Eon function to purify the air, and supports up to 4K at 60 Hz. Taking a look inside the box, you get the manual and a warranty card, a USB-C to USB-C cable, and then you have the dock itself. So taking a look at the dock, this is definitely a lot smaller than I thought it would be. When you consider it, this is not only a dock, but has an air purification feature as well. That's actually very impressive. I own quite a few docks and the majority of them are typically a lot taller and bulky than this. To put the size into perspective, this is actually smaller than a soda can, so you can easily toss this into your bag and barely even realize it's there. There's really not much going on design-wise, and personally I think this would have looked a lot more modern if it was in a dark gray or black color. The all-white is okay, but for me it's just a little too plain looking. So taking a look at the ports, in back of the dock you have a 1GB Ethernet port, two USB 2.0 ports, an HDMI which supports up to 4K at 60 Hz, the USB-C data port which can do 10 gigabits per second, and lastly a USB-C charging port which can charge at 100 watts. Coming to the front you have your power port here on top, two USB 3.0s, a USB-C 3.0, and lastly your headphone port. All right, so I have it connected to my MacBook Pro right now, and as you can see the external monitor is working no problem at all. This one is only 1080p, but as I said earlier, you can use this dock with up to 4K at 60 Hz. Again, I just love how small this dock is. Not only does it help clear up space on your desk, but it also helps get rid of the clutter that you'll typically have from wires running all over the place. Then, as an added bonus, the entire time you're sitting here at your computer, your air is automatically being cleaned and freshened up as well. So right now I have a 65 watt power adapter plugged into the dock, so it is charging up my computer as well. But if you like, on some computers like mine, you can also use the dock without a power adapter as well. So I did do a data transfer test to see how the speeds are on the dock's USB-C port, and this is the results I got. So overall, it's not the fastest speed out there, but these speeds are pretty typical for USB 3.0. If you do want faster transfer speeds, Cable Creation does sell Thunderbolt docks as well, but in my opinion, the speeds on this dock should be good enough for most people. Overall, this is definitely a great little dock, and having a built-in air purifier is not something I have seen before. So overall, if you are looking for an affordable but well-performing docking station, I highly recommend taking a look at this one here from Cable Creation. All right, well, that about wraps up this video. As usual, if you have any questions at all, feel free to drop me a comment. Otherwise, thanks for watching, and I'll see you all next time.